Aloha, this is a brief and general reading for air signs. Air signs Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. I am Hawaiian Libra. Welcome to my channel. If you are 18 years and older, this channel is for you. If you are not 18 years and older, please swipe by or click off. And <clears throat> Although I am very clairvoyant, this reading is for entertainment purposes only. Mahalo. Okay, let's get started. Let's get started. Okay, so <clears throat> these brief astrological sign readings that I do is to um, <clears throat> give you the strengths and the needs. Yeah, list the strengths and the needs <clears throat> to help guide you. So... Strengths for air signs. So your houses is in 3rd, 7th, and 11th. It is rarefied air which usually surrounds the grace by this element as this is the marker of the intelligent, intellectual. Airy people are smart thinkers. See, and handle abstract reasoning well. They love, they love, let's see, to analyze, synthesize, and probe. They are about communication. They are alert, curious, <clears throat> and perceptive. They use all sides of the equation and are able to glean the best approach okay balance is very important um to these air signs um manifest they and manifest in the most humane way okay so their needs so their needs <clears throat> or their strengths, first let's start with the strengths. Their strengths is that they are objective, cooperative, cooperative, sorry. Bright and sh have bright and shiny um, idealism. They are clever and fair. Okay, um, the information, sorry, I should have told you the information that I got for their um, strengths and needs or <clears throat> there this generalization of this reading for air science i got this information oh gosh i know i wrote it down somewhere okay i think it was astrology astrology 101 astrology 1101 <clears throat> and i'll put post that link on the bottom okay i forgot to tell you that in the beginning so i apologize so it's just, this is just a general um, generalization that I got um, from this particular website. It is not from my own words. It is from Astrology 101. So I'll post that on the, or I'll put the link on the bottom. Okay, see. Okay, essential oils. So essential oils. I got that from the web same website that I usually get it from. Um, let me try and look for it. I will look for it right now. Okay, I think I have. Okay, the website for the general reading was from um, yeah, astro it says astrology astrology dot com, but I do believe it was from Astrology One Hundred and One. And then um, okay, so the. Let me look for that site because I want to give the um, best information. Okay, the for the crystals, because I'm going to go over your crystals that can help you, is from tarotastrology.co.uk. Okay, and then the essential oils is from rockymountainoils.com. So it's the same um, websites that I got for the other signs, except for the, um, I couldn't find... Love to know. I couldn't find any. Um, I only found like Aquarius on Love to Know on that website. So I went to the astrology. I think it's called Astrology 101. I'll find it and I'll put it in the box below. Okay, so <clears throat> for oils, um, let's see what you got. Aquarius, 
cedar wood, black pepper, uh, helichai chrysium, um, glymentral folium. Okay. And then Gemini, you got tangerine, jasmine, and I think you pronounce it lang lang. Libra, you got rosemary, tea tree, and spike net. Spike net. Okay, crystals for air signs. <clears throat> okay, the, this is the one I got from Tarot Astrology, C-O-U-K. Okay, so Aquarius, you got um, Christ, wait, Christ, Brian, Amethyst, like this, Amethyst, right here. Oops, sorry. Amethyst. I see Dream Quartz, pre night Amber, Labodite, Pyrite, Blue Lace ag Agate, Rose Quartz, Elbite, Blue Obsidian, and Merlinite. Gemini, you got Green Aventurine, Lapis Lazuli, Blue Sapphire. Um, I think this is pronounced Amber. Apoth wait, ap Apopiliate, um, Aphrisodite, Celeste. Chrysocola, through light, Ulexite, and Vancet site. A lot of sites. Agate, um, Eucryptic, and Hyper, Hypersterion, and Albite. Excuse me for you, Crystal um, experts. Sorry for mispronouncing some of this. Libra, you got Tanzanite, Sardazite, Chia um, Solite. Rainbow Moonstone, Rose Quartz, um, Blue Samite, Morganite, Euphelite, Hyperster, Priestonite, and Lilac Lepidolite. Okay. And let's see. Um, <clears throat> okay, so I did I go over your guys' needs? Okay, needs. Okay, for the needs. And then I'll go over the essential oils. Okay, overthinking and, and, and decisiveness. And this wasn't on the website. This is just from experience as a Libra. Overthinking and indecisiveness because we are intelligent and we like to probe and, and we like to analyze, right? As Like the website said, but it didn't mention about overthinking or indecisiveness. Okay, and that's one thing about analyzing. Yes, in my air signs, I like to analyze. Analyzing articles from to compare it to what i know from experience as a libra and and see what the astrologers say kid um that website said to tr um you turn cold if equilibrium equilibrium is upset and i just gotta agree with that and you blow hot and cold okay yeah. semi kind of agree with that too um so these crystals can help you know, when you get upset, can can be used for calming. This amethyst, very beautiful. By the way, you can win one of these if you donate to Iolani Palace, ten dollars or more. This is, you get one of these and you get a Hawaiian print mask, and the the retail for that is way above ten dollars. Okay, so <clears throat> please donate to Iolani Palace. Iolani Palace. The information is on is down below for. Those of you that are from the other continent that don't know about Iolani Palace, it is a palace in Hawaii that was um, that the last kings and queen of Hawaii lived in the palace. Okay. Okay, and then another thing. Um, <clears throat> let's see. Another thing is essential oils. Okay, I gotta get on my air sign. Getting off balance over here. Okay. Aquarius. Aquarius is cedar wood, black pepper, helichrysum, and glymnosemphium, phallium. For you crystal experts, excuse on my pronunciation. Gemini, tangerine, jasmine, lang lang. Oh, I, I said this one already. I'm sorry, I did it. Okay, so those are the essential oils and the crystals for this um for this brief reading, okay, for all air signs. Okay, so um, we're, I'm gonna pull out some cards for you air signs to give just a general reading for air signs for the month of July. And then I'll be doing um, air signs individually um, probably this week, 
Okay, but this one is the general overall energy. Mahalo, God of Light and Truth, and Goddess of Light and Truth. Uh, thank you, God of Light and Truth, and um, Goddess of Light and Truth. What can you tell us for our intellectual, our awesome, <laughs> lovely Libras? What kind of messages can you give us? Honua by a I. Mahalo, mahalo, mahalo. I already know it. After I did my weekly reading, I did shuffle the cards. So I don't know why I'm doing it again. Mahalo, mahalo, mahalo. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, what kind of messages can you give our air signs for? And I'm using the Kumu cards just to let you know. For um, a general, the general energy for this month of July 2020. Show us clearly, show us clearly, please. For all air signs, show us clearly. What is the overall energy? Show us some messages of the overall energy. That is so funny. Okay. Monaco. Monaco is mango. And that's so funny because someone gave us a bunch of mangoes. Yeah. So this is very good for your health. It has, I believe, vitamin C. And it's so sweet and juicy. And it's just tasty. So air signs, I'm just getting that this is what you, um, during this time, like right after COVID, quarantine, all that stuff, um, well, the numbers are still increasing for COVID-19. Um, you, you might have to bulk up on some vitamin C. Yeah. Okay, papale, papale. It's just saying, Spirit is just telling me that, and some, for some of you that are watching it from hot places, I think most of you live in hot weather to use a papale papale means hat in hawaiian and then pu'el spirit is just saying that this is who you are like full of wisdom and in and very intelligent so that's what that's who that's who you are the pu'el means owl in hawaiian okay <clears throat> let's get down to the lemuria the beyond lemuria cards now Mahalo, mahalo. Thank you, God of Light and Truth, Goddess of Light and Truth, our angels, and mahalo to our ancestors. What kind of messages can um, we, you share with with our air signs for this brief reading for July 2020? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Show us clearly, please. Whoa, okay. I'm going to keep this one. And then grab all this one. Okay. So healing. Healing right now. So I'm just getting that you're going through the process of healing. Or you will be going through this process of healing. <clears throat> Unconsciously or consciously. Um, you're going to find better things. Quality things that uh, you, can, you can use. You can utilize in your life. That's so what um spirit is telling me or the ancestors is telling me and you are a healer air signs you are you can see fat, um different perspectives and from each side home home spirit is just telling me that some of you may go back home like i'm talking about not physically in a 3d but home like um, where your DNA connects you, it could be um, some kind of, it could be the Lemuria energy, but I'm just getting, um, I'm getting that message. Could be like Pleiades, but just remembering where home was. Um, and then some kind of connection to um, ancient wisdom. And then the second thing was remember like things, uh, Spirit is saying, like telling me to tell you guys remember what you was taught from home for whoever i don't know if that if that resonates with you guys air signs but yeah that's what i got okay the sound of the universe the sound of the universe i'm um just getting that uh maybe to play some one message was to play some music meditation music 
because that is a reflection of the universe and how it actually sounds. Um, or it's also seeing like a, um, you know, those sound bowls, those bowls that you, um, you, <clears throat> you bang it and then it makes that ringing sound, a healing bowl and it makes a sound. Um, yeah, it, it's saying that some of you have those and are using it and some of you that don't, um, maybe you could get one. That's what, that's what I'm getting. And then, and then another message I got is, um, you know, like when the stars are shining brightly at night, cause it's summer. Yeah. So to go outside and just listen to the universe, cause I, I think they're, they want to give you some messages. They want to give you messages from above. That's what um, Spirit is telling me. Okay, and now we're going to do the Archangel cards. Um, mahalo. Thank you, Ancestors, Archangels, God of Light and Truth, Goddess of Light and Truth. Okay, I'm just going to take those cards. Okay, decision. Remember I said our needs is... We're indecisive, so the, you know, I, I come, came up with essential, well, I researched essential oils, it wasn't my idea, and I researched about crystals, right? So, it says decision, right? So, let's see what it says. Our angel jovial, release yourself from that which holds you back, a need to detox, unnecessary worry based on a lack of self-confidence. So, some of you may be indecisive because of a uh, lack of self-confidence, not sure, not confident in your decision-making. Um, remember, we are indecisive and we wanna think, wanna pause and wanna think. Usually air signs like to pause and think, which one is the better route? Which one is the better dress? Which one is the better bank? Or which one is the most quality, qu what kind of quality, you know, um, essentials that, it's good for me. So, yeah. So this is our angel Jovio telling you to release yourself from what, from anything that holds you back. Yeah. Okay. Then we got the five of Raphael. Okay. So it's everything happens for a reason. Release regret and embrace the opportunities for happiness. Search for the silver lining. So yeah. <clears throat> Shit is going to happen, sorry to say. Um, shit will hit the fan. And we just have to get back on our feet and um, embrace um, and know that it happened for, for a reason, even though if it's unjust and unfair. But we'll learn about that reason probably later on in the future, you know, and... Um, yeah, we got to release any regrets we have. Like, you know, if you regret not going to college, it's not, never too late to, um, to go now, you know, um, and search for that silver lining in every, every, um, challenge, you know, every challenge. Uh, if we don't go through these challenges and it doesn't help our spiritual growth or our personal growth. Okay, five of Gabrielle, five of Gabrielle, a challenge you can resolve. See, we just talked about challenge and it pulled this out. Withdraw from the drama of others, have patience with yourself and those around you. So some of you may be going through a challenge. It could be anything at work or at home. Like I'm going through a challenge at home, but um, it's, it's, we can resolve it. We can resolve it. We can choose to you know not gossip with others not involve ourselves in the drama and we need to have patience with those around us yeah because they are growing as well okay i'm gonna flip that over mahalo god of light and truth goddess of light and truth ancestors and our angels what can you tell what kind of messages can you give us for the energy oracle cards for um, air signs, <clears throat> Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra. 
Mahalo, mahalo, mahalo. What else? Let's see. Okay. Okay, so you got six chakra or angel Metatron. Okay, Metatron, the Archangel Metatron. See how shiny everything looks? And this is bright. This is awesome right here. So Metatron is like a very useful um, um, Archangel. Like he helps with, um, I'm getting technical things. I'm just getting like the body in general. Um, not really placing it on one specific chakra, but the body in general is what we we need to look at yeah um like indulgence and stuff like that um but our angel metatron is just call upon him because i mean if if um that is you know um if you need help um call upon him just to um watch the technical part and the of your body the physical part as well um what else am i getting to help, I mean, I guess, aid you. To help aid you in healing the body. I'm just kidding that he helps with a lot of um, ailments in the body as well. Okay, that's, that's what I was getting from spirit. Okay, and then the third chakra, our angel Chamiel. Our angel Chamiel. So... Either they told me your stomach area, your heart area, and up here. These three places. Um, um, what were they seeing? Um, the masculine, if you are a, a male, or if you're a female, I have a lot of masculine energy. It says that you might need to weed and seed some... Um, um, some <clears throat> issues that you have, you might have to weed them out. And then, what else am I, am I getting for this one? I know determination as well. See how this guy, he looks pretty determined and start, yeah, when you're feeling um, w that you don't have confidence, he's one of the Archangel Chamio is one of, somebody that can get you started um, with your, yeah, with your um, with your chakras and help you in your whatever project you're starting. Okay, this seat. Okay, Libras or air signs. Sorry, uh, Gemini's and Aquarius. Okay, all air signs because you're so intelligent. You get the work done. Some people are like, "Wow, how did she do that? Oh, she did so much work. So that means, or he did so much work." So that means I have to live up to my boss's expectation and exceed that, you know. And some, uh, some I'm not going to say all other signs, but some people, some individuals have a hard time with intellect. You know, they, they don't know how to read fast enough. They don't know how to type fast enough. Um, they, they're, they might not be well-rounded well like you. So this card comes out sometimes, you know, you, you guys know how it is with jealous people and um, gossipers going to your boss or going to, you know, your landlord or, you know, you know, or your or even your spouse or your significant other and gossiping about you. Oh, she did this and she did that and da, 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 da. Instead of them concentrating on their own life and building up their coins and, you know, you guys know how this goes right air signs so you know um air signs uh we are so awesome at seeing um another person's point of view right so and of course we'll probably say oh that person air signs usually get mad at first and then we calm down and then we we say we think oh that person didn't have a good childhood or da 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 da, da or you know Oh, they went through some trauma. That's why, you know, they don't feel like that. Or they, they didn't graduate with a master's or they didn't finish high school. So maybe that's why it bothers them. They must have had a hard time growing up. And we always think of all these excuses for others, right? 
right so um so this card is coming up for the um the month of july and just know that it's just part of how we function with human beings we are part of what um i'm just gonna repeat what i heard from baby water tarot she says we're um uh, one consciousness or unified consciousness something like that so and that we are an aspect of each other we're not the same but we are an aspect of each other and so i just want to um bounce back on that that just know that these people that deceive us you know they might not have no life you know and then another aspect is um this could be like a devilish um energy coming in i'm not gonna say that i mean not exactly like satan just a negative energy coming in that we got a face, you know, um, air signs, and we are intelligent that we know how to, we know how to deal with this. We got our essential oils, we got our crystals, and we got our brains, and we got our spirituality, and we have our ancestors kicking ass. So not to be alarmed by um, this card, yeah. Okay, air signs, aloha ya oko, I love you so much, and stay tuned to my other. Uh, my other videos and please like and subscribe and press the notifications. Aloha Volya Oko. Love you all, air signs.